हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू योग बेला आई एम प्रीति आज है लास्ट डे ऑफ आर सेवन डे ब्यूटिफुल योगा जर्नी आज के दिन हम लोग फोकस करने वाले हैं योगा के डीप स्ट्रेचेस पर जिसमें मोस्ट ऑफ द पॉस्चर्स में वेट नीज पर होगा तो उसके लिए मैं आपको रिकमेंड करूँगी कि आप क्वेश्चन यूज़ करो नी के लिए सो so, अगर नी पैड है तो बहुत ही अच्छी बात है अगर नी पैड आपके पास नहीं है तो आप रेगुलर क्वेश्चन यूज़ कर सकते हो और अगर आपके पास दोनों ही नहीं है तो ड्यूरिंग प्रैक्टिस में आपको मैट को फोल्ड करके एक ट्रिक बताऊंगी उन पर्टिकुलर पॉस्चर्स के लिए एंड अगर लास्ट सिक्स डेज में आपकी बॉडी में कोई भी टेंशन या फिर सोनेस रह गई है तो वो आज के डीप स्ट्रेचेस के बाद रिलीज हो जाएगी तो फिर स्टार्ट करते हैं आज की प्रैक्टिस स्टार्ट करते हैं सिट इन एनी कंफर्टेबल सीटेड पोजीशन, स्पाइन अपलिफ्टेड शोल्डर्स कंप्लीटली रिलैक्स्ड, पाम्स टू द चेस्ट सेंटर टेक अ डीप ब्रेथ इन एक्सेल आउट कंप्लीटली Inhale for the Om Chant. Oh. Inhale. Oh. Inhale. Gentle blinks open your eyes. Namaste. We'll start with Malasana. With your elbows, push your knees out. Work on the length of your spine. Gaze forward, somewhere down. And breathe. One, two, three, four, and five. Now, staying in the same posture, release your right palm down, and your armpit goes down. release your right palm down to the right side and extend your left arm up looking up at your left thumb breathe there those of you are absolutely comfortable here you can go for a wrap wrapping it around your right knee look up breathe there 1 2 Three, four, and five. Now the other side. Release your left palm to the left side. Your armpit goes down. Extend your right arm up. You can stick to this posture if you are not comfortable with the bind. Breathe there, looking up at your right thumb. you are very comfortable here take your right arm bit little bit more down and wrap it one two three four and five slowly release now Dhruta Katasan where your knees and hip in one line feet wide approximately mat width apart your knees hip in one line join your palms and take your armpits down breathe there you'll feel a lot of stretch in your inner thighs one two 
three, four, and five. Release your fingertips down, straighten your legs. And now, place your palms behind your feet, your feet wider only, mat width apart. Placing your palms behind your feet, behind your um, ankle. Bend your knees, hips down, inhale, exhale, straighten. Down, inhale, exhale, straight. Down, inhale, exhale, straighten and hold. Be there. One, two, three, keep deepening it. Four, and five. Inhale, look forward. Exhale out completely. Fingertips down. Hands at your waist. Look ahead. Bend your knees. Slowly come up with an inhalation. Top of the mat. We'll go for two rounds of Surya Namaskar B. Before going for deeper stretches, your body should be nicely warmed up. Feet together, release your hands down. Inhale, Utkatasana. Extend your arms up, bend your knees. Exhale, bend forward. Inhale, look forward. Ardha Uttan. Now palms on the floor, step back to Chaturanga. As I already told you, if you are not comfortable with Chaturanga, you can always drop your knees down and upper body halfway. If you are very comfortable, directly Chaturanga. Urdhva Mukha. Adho Mukha. And now, bring your right foot forward in between your palms. Back heel down. Extend. Warrior One. Hold it there. One, two, three, four, and five. Palms down, right leg back. Chaturanga. Urdhva Mukha. Adho Mukha. Left foot forward. Back heel down. Extend. One, two, three, four, and five. Exhale, palms down, left leg back, Chaturanga, Urdhva Mukha, Adho Mukha, hold. Breathe there. One, Two, three, four, and five. Inhale, look forward. Exhale out completely. Step forward. To Ardha Uttan. Exhale, bend forward. Inhale, Utkata, chair pose. Exhale, Samasthiti. Second round. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, look forward. Ardha Uttan. Palms on the floor. Step back to Chaturanga Dandasana. Urdhva Mukha. Adho Mukha. Right foot forward, back heel down, warrior one. One, 
two, three, four, and five. Exhale, palms down, right leg back, Chaturanga. Urdu Mukha, Adhomka. Left foot forward, back heel down, warrior one. One, two, three, four, and five. Palms down, left leg back, Chaturanga. Urdu Mukha, Adho Mukha, hold. Breathe there. Gaze at your knees or at your navel. Center finger pointing forward. Inhale, look forward. Exhale out completely. Step forward. Toward the Uttar. Exhale, bend forward. Inhale, Utkata, chair pose. Sink down. We are going to hold this Utkatasana for next five breaths. Sink down, push your hips back, knees behind your toes, and extend. And Samastiti. Spread your legs wide, open your palms to the front, relax, observe your breath. Next posture is Prasarita Padottanasana. Feet together, take your left leg back to a big stance. Turn your right toes in and set your waist. Now that's a big stance. Inhale, lengthen your spine. Exhale, halfway down. First halfway down, place your palms down. And now, we'll do the preparation first, then we'll get into the pose. First, bend your knees down. Bring your thighs parallel to the floor. Inhale. Exhale, straighten. Inhale. Exhale, straighten. Inhale. Exhale, straighten. Inhale. Now this time, we'll hold. Exhale, straight. One. Two. Three. Keep deepening it. And the bend is coming from your lower back. Four. And five. Inhale, look forward. Exhale out completely. Now, grab your big toes with three finger grip. Thumb, index finger and center finger. Grab your big toes. And make sure you are grabbing like this. Never like this. Inhale, look forward, lengthen spine, exhale, fold forward. One, two, three, four, and five. Inhale, look forward. Exhale out completely. Place your palms down. Turn your right toes to the right side. Walk your palms to the right side. And now, send your right leg back to downward facing dog. We'll hold down dog for next five breaths. Keep your fingers wide open, center finger pointing forward.
Now bring your right foot forward outside of your right palm and drop your knee down. Sink down. With your right hand, push your right knee out. Look up to the ceiling and breathe there. One. Two. Three. Four. And five. Center. Palms down. Tuck your left toes, left knee off, send your right leg back. Downward facing dog. Now bring your left foot forward outside of your left palm, dropping your right knee down. Release your right toes. With your left hand, push your left knee out to the left side. Look up and breathe. One, two, three. four and five center now tuck your right toes right knee off send your left leg back to downward facing dog now bring your right foot forward in between your palms drop your left knee down agar aapke knee mein injury hai ya fir aap sirf apne knee ko safe rakhna chahte ho you can always use a cushion और दिस नी पैड अंडर योर लेफ्ट नी और अगर आपके पास दोनों ही नहीं है तो आप अपनी मैट को रोल कर सकते हो लेट मी शो यू यू कैन डू इट सिंपली लाइक दिस इसके ऊपर आप अपना नी रख सकते हो लाइक दिस यू कैन गो फॉर दी पॉस्टर सो एनी और अगर इंजरी नहीं भी है तब भी आप नी पैड यूज कर सकते हो उसकी नी की सेफ्टी के लिए एंड डीपर स्ट्रेचेस के लिए इट एक्चुअली टेक्स यू डीप इन दी स्ट्रेचेस सो नाउ विल गो फॉर अंजने आसना हैंड सेट योर वेस्ट पुश योर हिप्स फॉरवर्ड बिगिनर्स स्टिक टू दिस पॉस्चर ओनली फाइंड बैलेंस एयर ओनली इफ यू आर वेरी कंफर्टेबल पाम्स टू दी चेस्ट सेंटर You'll feel a lot of stretch on your left thigh, and if you're very comfortable, extend your arms up for Anjaneya. Still comfortable, bend back and go for five deep breaths. Palms to the chest center, and now. your left elbow outside of your right thigh and twist look up to the ceiling and twist 1 2 and 5 center palms down Tuck your left toes, left knee off. Send your right leg back. Bring your left foot forward in between your palms. Right knee down. Cushion under your right knee. Release your right toes. Hands at your waist. Beginner, stick to this position. Find balance. Only when you feel comfortable, palms to the chest center. If you're not feeling so comfortable to extend your arms up, you can stick to this posture. It's completely fine. Just make sure you are feeling this stretch on your right thigh. Now slowly extend your arms up and bend back. Five deep breaths. Palms to the chest center. Your right elbow outside of your left thigh and twist. One, two, three, 
फोर एंड फाइव स्लोली रिलीज योर पाम्स डाउन टक योर राइट टोज राइट नी ऑफ सेंड योर लेफ्ट लेग बैक डाउन विथ फेसिंग डॉग now next we'll go for lizard stretch right foot outside of your right palm left knee down if you are comfortable drop your left forearm down if you are still comfortable right forearm down but what if you are not comfortable in this posture you can stay on your palms it's completely fine and if you can drop your left forearm down but not able to drop your right forearm down in this case keep your left forearm down right palm down it is absolutely okay those of you are completely for completely fine left forearm down right forearm down into lock still comfortable tuck your left toes left knee off and breathe one Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Drop your left knee down. onto your palms and walk your right foot close to the left edge of the mat drop your right shin down release your left leg your right heel goes close to your left hip bone and your forearms down stay there keep sending your left leg back for a deeper stretch you are completely fine walk your palms forward and work on bringing your chest down close to the floor this is sleeping pigeon and now slowly walk your palms back if you are comfortable walk your hands back straighten your spine not so comfortable somewhere stuck there it's okay keep your palms down like this just make sure there is not too much pressure on your lower back while you are taking your hands back If you are still fine, take your hands off. If you are still fine, take your left hand back, hook it up in your left thigh, take your right hand off and twist. Breathe there. 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 release your right hand down place your right palm ahead of your right foot right fingertips ahead of your right foot bend your left knee simply grab your left foot only if you are very comfortable hook it up in your left elbow still comfortable extend your right hand up still comfortable interlock breathe there this is called as mermaid 1 and 5 slowly release your right palm down and your left leg onto your palms press your palms and your right leg back downward facing dog
now bring your left foot forward outside of your left palm drop your right knee down place your right forearm down sticking to any of the variation of lizard pose if you are comfortable both the forearms down interlock your fingers tuck your right toes right knee off breathe there One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Drop your right knee down onto your palms. Walk your left foot close to the right edge of the mat. Shin down. Your left heel goes close to the right hip bone. Send your right leg even more back for a deeper stretch on your forearms. Keep sending your right leg back for a deeper stretch. Now slowly walk your palms forward only if you are comfortable. Gently walk your palms back. If there are any of the variation which suits you, you can stay here. You can stay here. Or if you are very comfortable, start taking your palms off one by one, like this, like this. Palms to the chest center. Whichever variation suits you. And now. Slowly take your right hand back, hook it up in your right thigh, extend your left arm up, twist and breathe, one, two, three, four and five. Place your left palm ahead of your left foot, bend your right, grab your right foot. Only if you are very, very comfortable, hook it up in your right elbow. Still comfortable, left hand off, then hook it up, look up and breathe. Onto your palms, tuck your right toes, left leg back, downward facing dog. Drop your knees down, sit back, swing your legs forward, lie down. Now, bend your right knee, interlock your fingers outside of your right thigh, and take your right knee close to the chest. If you are very comfortable, you can grab your right shin and straighten your right leg. Two, three, four and five slowly release change bend your left interlock your fingers outside of your left thigh
comfortable, grab your shin, straighten. Bending both the knees. Now again, right foot on your left thigh. Placing, interlock your fingers outside of your left thigh or if you are very comfortable, outside of your left shin. Change. Placing your left foot on your right thigh. Interlock your fingers outside of your right shin. Or simply your right thigh, whatever suits you. release hug your knees to the chest simply relax your lower back and now release your legs shavasana spread your legs wide toes falling either side of the body palms facing up to the ceiling fingers naturally curled allow your armpits also to breathe do not hold on to any tension, just relax and let go. With every inhalation, feel the expansion of your abdomen. With every exhalation, your abdomen sinks down into the mat. Observe this abdominal movement while breathing. Now gently take your awareness to the right side of your body. Scan the entire right side of the body. Right hand, right shoulder, right side of chest, right side of abdomen, right leg, right foot. Entire right side is completely relaxed. Transferring awareness to the left side, left hand, left shoulder, left side of chest, left side of abdomen, left leg, left foot, it's completely relaxed. entire body is completely relaxed. There is no tension in your body. It's completely relaxed. Gently bring your awareness back to the body. Gentle movement in your fingers and your toes. Slowly 
move your head left right bring your feet together extend your arms up over your head interlock your fingers give a nice stretch from top to toes bend your left knee rolling on to the right side the moment you feel comfortable sit up in sukhasan keeping your eyes closed take a moment to acknowledge the experience of last practice observe the change in your mind which has come after the practice hands at the back grab your opposite elbows inhale bend back exhale bend forward send your gratitudes to the universal energy and be thankful to the mother earth slowly come up with an inhalation release your hands rub your palms nicely generate the heat transfer this heat to that body part which you want to heal once again rub your palms cup your eyes looking straight into your palms gently open your eyes palms to the chest center Namaste. Thank you so much for your practice. आज कंप्लीट होती है हमारी सेवन डे योगा जर्नी कल मैंने आप लोगों को कहा था कि अपने पास एक डायरी रखना उसमें आप क्या लिखेंगे ये मैं आपको बताती हूँ इसमें दो सेक्शन होंगे एक सेक्शन होगा ग्रेटिट्यूड का एक होगा पर्सनल एक्सपीरियंस का ग्रेटिट्यूड में आपको क्या लिखना है पहले मैं ये बताती हूँ तो आपको अवेयरनेस है कि योगा करना चाहिए आप लकी हो कि आप योगा प्रैक्टिस कर पाए तो आप किन चीज़ों के लिए एंड किन लोगों के लिए थैंकफुल हो उन्हीं सब चीज़ों के नाम लिख देना एंड पर्सनल एक्सपीरियंस में आपने इमोशनली मेंटली फिजिकली इन सात दिनों में कैसा महसूस किया वो लिखना है आई एम रियली थैंकफुल आपने सेवन डेज मेरे साथ प्रैक्टिस किया अगर आपने सेवन डेज जर्नी कंप्लीट कर ली है तो कॉमेंट सेक्शन में सेवन डेज डन ज़रूर लिख देना और अगर आपको मेरे साथ प्रैक्टिस करके मज़ा आया और मुझे थैंक यू बोलना चाहते हो तो प्लीज़ चैनल को सब्सक्राइब कर लेना मैं इससे पहले इंडिविजुअल आसनास के डिटेल ट्यूटोरियल्स बना चुकी हूँ अदर सीक्वेंसेस बना चुकी हूँ वेट लॉस से रिलेटेड ट्यूटोरियल्स हैं तो आप वो सब जाके चेक कर सकते हो सो सी यू अगेन विद मोर सच योगा स्टफ नमस्ते